If I have a VFD that blew fuses at a customer's site and second shift is just itching to replace the fuses and let the smoke out again, this is the procedure that I use to static check the drive before powering it up. Uh, first, I'm gonna use the uh, diode check on my fluke meter. We're gonna be looking for a good voltage drop and we're going to do something what seems a little bit backwards, but uh, we're gonna check the diodes here by placing the black lead on the positive DC bus connection. And we're gonna leave that one there and we're gonna go on and we're gonna see. What we wanna see is typically on a new drive, we're gonna see a pre-charged circuit and it doesn't actually do anything on the first three. Whenever we go to the outputs, we'll hear the good solid one single beep and that will indicate a voltage drop. We wanna see it nice and stable and solid and even with the others. If we have a short, that's gonna be zero volts. It's gonna keep on beeping at us and that is no good. That indicates that the diode is actually shorted in there and we're gonna have more significant repairs more than likely needed. We're gonna do the opposite now. We're gonna take our red lead, put it on the DC bus minus and we're gonna go through. In this side, we should see the rectifier diode uh, 0 0.439, 0 0.444, and 0.447. Those three are good diode junctions, and I would say that this drive is going to be safe to power up here in my shop. Uh, if we do have anything that beeps like that, we will need to take it apart and do some further investigating.